John Downs was named president and CEO of the NCA Chocolate Council in 2014. As the chief representative of the association, he manages strategic direction and daily operations of the Washington, D.C.-based trade group and serves as the primary voice for the U.S. confectionery industry. Before joining the confectionery industry, he had a 28-year career at Coca-Cola. He holds a BA degree in political science from Washington College in Maryland and has done graduate work with the MBA program at Loyola College in Baltimore. It's with great pride that I introduce John Day. Joanne for that very nice introduction. Uh, good afternoon everyone. It's a, uh, it's a real pleasure and an honor for us to be here today uh, to celebrate and recognize the, uh, the importance of STEM education and uh, our partnership uh, at this special occasion with, uh, with our industry. Um, and we get the chance to talk about the development of future leaders in the areas of science and technology and engineering and math, etc. And uh, the scholarship programs, the competitions, the educator enrichment programs that the Center for Excellence in Education operates are first class in our country and we're so honored to serve as a sponsor for this luncheon. So David and Joanne, thank you very much uh, for welcoming us uh, here today. I'm not only joined by a few members of our staff, uh, on our NCA staff. Some of you may have had a chance to meet them uh, at the Story of Chocolate table back there, but we also have a few representatives from our great member companies in our industry, and uh, you were talking about the experience in Hershey, so we have Deb Miller here from Hershey, and we have uh, Jeannie Murphy from Ferrero, and we have Kelsey Freeman uh, from Nestle uh, with us, and I must tell you, uh, when I first got this role, I went on my listening and learning tour, and I, I have visited almost 50 companies in my first uh, 15 months on the job. So I've been in a lot of the factories, and that is, that's where the magic happens, uh, as you said. So when I've had the opportunity to be at Hershey and see the magic, I've had the opportunity to see the magic in Alba with Ferrero, and I've also had the opportunity to uh, see Nestle's process as well. So uh, it's, also a great, uh, it's also a great honor for us to be here today because we do have uh, members of Congress that are joining us later. I just wanted to do a shout out. Um, Joanne told me that uh, Congresswoman Barbara Comstock is, is coming later and, uh, and uh, Congressman Scott Peters uh, is coming from, um, from California, San Diego, Dr. Taub. And, I, I've had the chance to spend some time with both, uh, both of those members, both Barbara and Scott, um, in my previous role, but in this role as well. And I got to tell you, they are two, you know, one's a Democrat, one's a Republican, but they're two very pragmatic, solution-oriented -orient members of Congress. Um, and we need, we need more of those kind of representatives in our country so we can get some things done in a bipartisan way. The other thing is uh, uh, California is one of the top confectionery producing states in the country uh, and produces quite a lot of chocolate out there in California, so we're, we're very proud of that. I, I don't think there's an industry today that doesn't benefit from smart, talented uh, young people who pursue uh, vigorous education in, in the sciences, like a STEM education. On our own staff at NCA, uh, who's here with us today, Laura Shomro, she is uh, part of that. She's our food and candy scientist. I don't know where Laura is here in the room, but if you could raise your hand, Laura, that would be great. Oh, there she is over there. Uh, she went to the uh, to the University of Wisconsin, so she's a proud uh, a proud Badger. Yes, exactly. <laughs> um, and in our industry uh, as well, Joanne, you probably saw on your plant tour, you see that. The scientists and the engineers and the technologists, um, they play key roles for all of our member companies in our manufacturing process. And uh, 
from designing complex machinery in terms of the production facilities to design, design certain parts of logistics of the warehouses to uh, really understanding the ingredients uh, that go into the products and the, uh, and the process. It, it's uh, making chocolate and candy, it, it's complicated. It's, it's, it's a very complicated process. There are lots of moving parts uh, to the industry and to the business. And we couldn't be as innovative and as responsible of an industry and as transparent in terms of our process without the help of uh, STEM programs at the high school, the college, and uh, postgraduate levels. So I'm very honored to be here with our team and our member companies to meet uh, Amol Panjabi, uh, the talented student from Harvard, who's with us today. And we're also, uh, Dr. Tall, very excited to, uh, to see your presentation. Uh, we haven't had a chance to see it. I haven't had a chance to see it, so I'm looking forward to it. And uh, we appreciate all the uh, all the things you do for research at uh, UC San Diego and your role. And I know you're going to tell us more about what you've uncovered uh, in some of uh, in some of your research. Um, we uh, we also firmly believe that a little bit of chocolate uh, can be a nice uh, reward or a nice treat. Uh, but it's also uh, good for your well-being, and if you look at some of the emerging science over the last 20 years, uh, there's a lot of things going on related to the consumption of chocolate, uh, and especially dark chocolate as it relates to emerging science. So as Joanne said to you earlier, uh, we're going to have a chocolate lunch today. Um, I, hope, uh, I hope everyone in the room likes chocolate because we've got chocolate glazed chicken. We have roasted salmon with cocoa nibs. We have uh, a nice table of chocolate desserts back there for you as well. And at your place setting, we have our messaging around the power of sweet as it relates to our economic impact for our industry in the United States uh, with some great uh, chocolate products from our member companies for you to take with you. And if you didn't get a chance to stop by the table in the back of the room, uh, we have our team back there to talk about the story of chocolate. So please enjoy your lunch. Thank you for having us. Bon appetit.